We are here in an empty garage because we found Rodney Childers, the crew chief for the number four, late night, loading up everything. You guys finished with the top 15 here, but I want to talk about your driver, Josh Berry. You showed sparks of life at Bristol with the speed, and now you come to another short track. What more do you guys need to capitalize moving forward on other short tracks, knowing that you have the speed? Yeah, we've been really fortunate to have some good cars at some of these short tracks, and Honestly, he's done a good job all year. I think it's kind of went under the radar that, you know, Atlanta, I felt like we had a great car. We could have won the race there and ended up getting in a wreck. But overall, like all weekend this weekend, you could just see it in him that he had a lot of confidence coming here. You know, he had the opportunity to race the nine car last year and learned a lot. Um, but, you know, it was just a smooth weekend to get up there and to run second to Martin for a long time. You know, it was a huge confidence booster for all of us. Uh, we had a couple stops not go our way on pit road, but overall to, to bring it home 11th wasn't bad. We wanted a lot more than that, but um, you know, I, one of my engineers told me we've already passed six cars and points in points this weekend, so that's a good thing. we got to keep clawing our way up there, and um, you know, the more you claw your way up there and the more you have these good runs, the better qualifying draws you get and different things, and that would have just helped our whole weekend out if we could have just had a better draw. Uh, yesterday. So overall, great week, uh, weekend and, and he did a great job. Finally, I, you're one of these old members of Stuart Haas Racing. You've seen the change in the guard with drivers now seven races into the season. How do you feel about this young this Cup Series foursome that's come together there? It's different. You know, um, I've learned a lot. You know, I, I have to say that, you know, with not working with a rookie for a long time, the sports changed a lot and it's extremely hard on the rookies. Um, you know, I told somebody last weekend, I feel like we set him up to fail. And all, in all honesty, he's done a great job for us, and we just got to keep growing every week and, um, you know, not getting that practice and not getting to go run on these road courses and testing and different things is really hard on these rookies. And, um, you know, hopefully we can keep giving him good cars on the weekends and he can focus on the things that he can do better and not have to worry about whether we're going to take wedge in or out or whatever after practice. So. Um, we just kind of, we just got to keep putting them together, you know, like putting weekends together, have nice smooth stops, not make mistakes, and uh, just knock out some top tens. And the more you knock out those top tens, you know, the, the more chances you're going to have a win in a race. Thank you, RC. Thank you.